as if your neighborhood streets are still covered in ice, you're not alone. While the main roads are clear, many people are having to drive on slick roads to get in and out of their neighborhoods. KSMT News reporter Willis Scott is in a neighborhood where the streets haven't recovered from last week's snowstorm. Willis, what has the city done about these street issues? The public works director says they've fully implemented the usual plan for clearing the roads. They started by plowing and treating the main and secondary streets. On Tuesday, they moved to treating neighborhood streets. And as of today, they say they've treated 100% of the streets. But as one person who lives in this neighborhood points out, the roads are still icy. It's definitely slick uh, just coming up the road. I mean, if you tap on the brakes a little too much or the gas a little too much, it'll definitely slide or hear the tires spin. And it's, I mean, it's slick. And as you can see from people driving by, there, nobody's moving very quickly. Now, you won't see any snow plowing in your neighborhood unless there's a snow emergency. That's defined as six or more inches of snow. So while the city has spread salt and calcium on this road, the people who live here are just going to have to wait for the sun and warm temperatures to finish the job. Reporting live in South Topeka, Willis Scott, KSNT News. And the city also says heat from your car's tires can help melt the ice. And they suggest using your winter driving skills to maneuver on those streets. They say salt will do its job over time, but may not be a concern for long as it starts to melt pretty soon.